everyone welcome back to a new what i wore in a week so this little doggy likes to get in on the action every time but you're not styling anything today so you can't wear you can't be on the video so you've not got your outfits on <laughs> okay <laughs> so it's actually thursday the 21st of July. Um, I've just realized that it's absolutely boiling, but I don't know whether that's in our house. So it's a new house that retains heat really easily. Oh, squeaky toy, just as I'm filming, great. Um, honestly, if there's noise, he can make it. If there's disruption, he will do it. Um, anyway, we're heading out. It's Tim's dad's birthday today. We've got a good few days of stuff planned. So I thought I'd show you my outfits over these next few, <laughs> thought I'd show you my outfits over these next few days, what I'm wearing. So today's Tim's dad's birthday, tomorrow's my mum's birthday. So we're going out on Saturday. So we've got a few like kind of things that we're doing. Um, and I'm just putting this jumpsuit on. We're actually just going around for a takeaway this evening um, to his mum and dad's house with the family. So this is what I'm wearing, but actually, <laughs> I'm so warm now, I need to go and stand outside and see what the actual temperature is. I'm so warm now that I'm feeling like I might need to change because even this is like boiling. It's just a jumpsuit, which I love. So, so, so comfortable. If you're having a takeaway, it's just so soft. It's like the softest denim. Really, really comfortable, easy to wear. Um, and it's just one piece, you don't even have to think about it. I feel like today's been one of those days just one of those days and um, I just wanted something to throw on that was comfortable and easy and that looked all right. So this Free People jumpsuit ticks all of the boxes. I love it just with sandals, like strappy sandals like these, my Tiki's ones. Simple jewelry, just got some pieces, my Sahara earrings on from my collection with North School Woman. I've uh, got my nails done, had them done today. This hand is better. Uh, I have no idea what shade this is. Sorry, but it's like this summery ready orange. But this is what I'm wearing anyway. My new sunflowers in the background. Oh, and I had my hair cut yesterday too. I prefer this kind of bob. It gives me so much more volume in my hair. But yeah, this is outfit of the day. Tomorrow, I don't really think I'm doing anything. Tim is out the cricket all day, so I'm just kind of doing jobs that need finishing off for the week. I might show you my outfit tomorrow and then we're going out on Saturday as well. So I'll show you my outfit then. But yeah, this is outfit to du jour. And welcome to a new what I wore in a week. That's our bottle of wine we're gonna take. 19 Crimes Red Wine. It's really good. Um, if you've not had it before, I would highly recommend. But yeah, outfit of the week and wine of the week. And now he decides to settle down. He always falls asleep <laughs> with things in his mouth, don't you? Hello everyone, so it's now Saturday the 23rd and this is what I'm wearing, going out for lunch with a friend and we're taking the dogs with us as well but we're staying in Manchester. So yeah, this is what I'm wearing, it's weird weather day to day, it's like kind of warm but not warm so um, I didn't really know what to go with. So I think this is what I'm gonna wear. It's just this tank top from Arquette. Just a very simple one that I kind of go to time and time again. These trousers are from Weekday. My new ones are absolutely obsessed with these. Really great shape and fit. My belt from Anderson's, um, which kind of match my shoes, my St. Agne shoes. And then this belt, not belt, this is definitely not a belt. Blazer is from Sana New York. So this is kind of my look, I think. I don't know, it feels quite baggy. Tell the Bing vibes, but I do quite like it. It's quite simple. And yeah, just didn't really know what to put on with this weather. So hopefully this ticks the right boxes. And then we're going out this evening as well for a meal, just like a pub meal. So um, I'll show you what I'm wearing to that too. Maybe I'll do something similar. Um, but yeah, this is Saturday. Oh, oh, TD. Change of plan, guys. This is what I'm gonna wear, I think. <laughs> it's just one of those days when you can't decide what the weather's doing. So I kind of went outside, it was quite warm. And it's only quite early, so I feel like it's gonna get warmer, but there's no sun. 
Anyway, let's let's roll with this for now. So I've got this Zara shirt on. Uh, it's like a linen crop shirt, which is great for tucking into trousers. Um, these trousers are from Marcella, I think. Yeah. Um, really easy to wear. And then I've kept on the same belt and shoes. So let's hope this works. Okay, so it's the evening now. Um, I had a lovely day out, but this is what I'm wearing uh, to go out tonight for another meal. We went to Kanto today um, in Ancoats, which was really, really nice, but off out for my second meal of the day. And this is what I'm wearing. Um, it's this Zara set, which I have shown you before. No, I've not. I've shown Instagram before, um, but it's just really comfortable, easy to throw on. And yeah, I think it looks nice and something a little bit different. My Aloha heels, just like a slip on kind of heel. And then these earrings from Mango and my bracelets. So, so this is what I'm wearing and I'll finish off, I think, just with a simple bag. Hey guys, it is Monday morning. It's about half nine, I think. And we're getting ready because we're going to a spa today. Uh, we're going to Rudding Park Spa, which is actually where we went for Tim's 30th birthday, which was nearly three years ago now. So um, we're heading back for the night, um, which should be really, really nice. Just for a little kind of chill, really. <laughs> we just thought we'd get it booked in whilst it was summer, but saying that it's raining. So they've got like an outdoor pool, which is so, so lovely. I feel like it will, hopefully if it dries off, it'll be okay. But if not, we'll just have to stay indoors. But anyway, this is what I'm wearing for our travels. It's like a two hour drive. So this is what I'm wearing. Had a lovely weekend. I didn't show my outfit yesterday because we were just at my mum and dad's just kind of chilling out. This is what I'm wearing today. I've got my cashmere jumper on from Philippa K, which is just such a lovely piece. I just love throwing this on in the summer on a cooler day with some loose trousers. It's a really easy look and I just feel like the shape of this is so beautiful. I think it's really hard to come by like a good jumper that looks good um, and is the right kind of shape, fit, colour, falls nicely at the neckline. Um, it's obviously a bit more of an expensive piece with it being cashmere. It's really one of those that will stand the test of time and it's really easy to wear and you can wear it all seasons too. Uh, Jewellery, I've got my North School earrings on from my collection with them. Uh, Monica Vineda necklace and yeah, uh, these trousers my Officine General ones and Adidas Stan Smiths. So I think I'm gonna pop my trench coat with this and I've got my pull -em bag that I'm gonna put with it too. So I'll just maybe quickly grab those and show you what they look like. But this is one of my kind of rainy day, cooler summer day outfits. So just if we kind of go on a walk or something whilst we're there, they've got really nice grounds. Um, I can pop my trench coat on if it's a bit rainy and my pull-in Paris bag just to kind of finish it off, but just quite an easy, minimal kind of outfit. Hello everyone. We are now at Rudding Park. Well, we've been here for quite a while. Been here all afternoon and had a really nice time. It was chucking it down this morning. <laughs> On our drive here, it was raining. And then when we got here, it came really nice and sunny to the point where we were in the outdoor pool and I'm a little bit burnt on the shoulder. Well, not burnt, but just a little bit, a little bit red. It was a really, really nice afternoon. Just chilled at the spa. We didn't get any treatments or anything. Um, we weren't really so bothered about that. We just wanted to relax, use the pool and the steam rooms, etc. cetera. Um, so that's what we did. And yeah, we've just been in the room, um, chilling out and then just got ready and we're gonna go for something to eat, which is very exciting. Um, they've got two restaurants here. One is called the Horto Restaurant, which is a bit more of a kind of fine dining tasting menu, maybe? Vegan. Be vegan. Um, we are not vegan. So um, we've gone for the what other... We? We've gone for the other restaurant which is called the clock tower which is just more like kind of normal menu like not a set menu or anything like that so so yeah we're gonna go now um but obviously this is what i'm wearing so 
I'm probably better getting Tim to show you. Might try it in the mirror first and see what happens. This light is tragic. Okay, it's a little bit better further away. I've got this jumpsuit on from Mango, which is a new purchase. It's like a beige, but it's got these kind of cap sleeves, a bit Isabel Morant inspired with this kind of cap sleeve, if you can see it in this very harsh light, um, with a bit of a puff and then the waist, um, and then these straight legs, which I really like. It's also very, very comfortable. However, it is it gapes open to down here. So if you sit down, it just completely gapes open. So I've put a bit of a pin in there. Um, which hopefully you can't really see, but I think the pin will stop it from, well, it has stopped it from gaping over. My earrings are also from Mango, actually, unintentional. But you might have seen me in these before. I wore them when we went to Bath, actually. I took them with me, but they're just a really easy earring to dress up your outfits. And then my Massimo Duty sandals. So maybe Tim could get a better clip of the outfit. So this is finished look and I've just completed it with my Palem bag this is the only bag I've taken um, with me because it just goes with everything and also looks quite dressy for the evening but can be dressed down for daytime too so the outfit of the night last time we were here it was literally three years ago almost well like a couple of weeks off last time we were here it was <laughs> Almost, no, okay. Last time we were here was almost three years ago to the day we came for Tim's 30th with his twin brother. Yeah, it's now quite nice to come back actually. Totally different room, but um, it's still just as lovely. And if I remember correctly, the restaurant was really nice. So I'm quite excited to go. Shall we go? Please. Let's go. Good morning, everyone. So it's the next day now. Tuesday morning and it's such a miserable day actually. It's raining. Well, it's kind of like drizzling. It's not very pleasant, but anyway, um, we've just had breakfast at the hotel. So lovely. Um, one of the breakfast rooms has like an olive tree inside it, really nice rattan chairs, um, and views out to the garden, it's lovely. Um, so we sat there and had our breakfast, feeling very full now. This is what I'm wearing today. I'll just show you outside. So that is the spa over there. And just see it and then um, down below the bottom um, is another restaurant and some of the gardens really really pretty view and then some of the lower rooms have little um, decking areas it's very pretty but um, anyway outfit my outfit so I've got this um, cashmere jumper on again from Philippa K put my low ever sunglasses on but I don't think I'll be needing these um, my Zara linen shirt Monica Vinader necklace these trousers from weekday which I featured in a recent video and my Stan Smiths and we're going to attempt a little walk I'm going to put my trench coat on um, we're going to attempt a little walk around the gardens <laughs> so we shall see I'll show you in the mirror, although the mirror's not very good. So this is my outfit, just very relaxed and comfy. I think we're gonna go into Harrogate later um, because we're basically there now. So we may as well just drive into the town, have a little look around before we head back. But um, attempt a little walk this morning um, and hope we don't get soaking wet. I've got my trench coat to put on. But, um, it's a very easy, casual, relaxed outfit today. Hi everyone. So outfit of the day for Wednesday. I'm all mixed up because we were out Monday, Tuesday. So it's now Wednesday. It's kind of got a Monday feel. Um, been working this morning, filming some reels. Sausage stretch. Filming reels and yeah, this is what I'm kind of gonna put on for the day now. So it's from my collection with Pretty Lavish. It's a Benny play suit. It also comes in like a buttery yellowy shade, it's really gorgeous yellowy shade, but I didn't want to wear that because I've done my fake tan and although it's dried um, and shouldn't really transfer, I don't like to risk it. So um, I'm wearing the Benny play suit. So if I go out, I feel like I'm pulled together, um, but it's also really, really comfortable with the elasticated waist um, and just looks chic, really easy to dress up and down. 
I've put my Veiler sunglasses with them and then just my chunky sandals from our cat. So this is outfit of the day for Wednesday. Okay, everyone. So heading down to London today with Freya, we're actually going to meet a PR company down there. Did I mention this yesterday? I can't remember. Anyway, I'm in a mega hurry um, because I didn't know what to wear. And you know when you're just really not feeling your outfit that much. But anyway, I've got this linen um, blazer on from Sana New York, my aunt um, vest top, Anderson's belt, trousers by, I think these are Marcella. And then my sandals are from um, St. Agni. Um, and Bottega sunglasses, and I'm just gonna take my Dior bag, which I just don't feel goes at all, but hey ho, this is the outfit. Final outfit of the week. Um, yesterday, we actually didn't end up going to London. So we managed to get on the train, um, it got to Crewe and then it terminated at Crewe and we had to get off basically and there were going to be no other trains down to London um, that day and afterwards I read that disruptions um, were on until seven o'clock that night. The chances of us actually making it back were also really slim so um, it was just basically an impossible situation um, and we had to cancel the day and <laughs> just ended up getting a train home from Manchester. Fortunately, although there were a lot of delays, we managed to get on one fairly quickly. So we just stayed in Manchester yesterday and we just decided to go out for some lunch because we'd sort of scheduled to have that day free. So we had some lunch and we also did like her um, dilemmas question and answer on Freya's vlog. So I don't know when that's going up, but you'll probably be able to see that soon. Um, so anyway, this is what I'm wearing today. It's Friday morning. I'm actually just gonna meet one of my friends for some brunch. I think we're gonna go to Selfridges. She lives in Wales now, so um, we don't get to see each other that often, but she was up this weekend, so I wanted to try and make some time to see her. And yeah, so we're about to go out. Um, it's about half nine now, and this is what I've got on. So this is my Jane and Tash jacket. It's like weirdly raining, a little bit sunny, but I don't know, it just doesn't feel like great weather. Jane and Tash leather jacket. Um, T-shirt is just, and oh no, this is my naked one. Naked fashion. Um, my trousers are weekday, um, which you'll have seen me in quite a bit probably. YSL belt, um, my trainers, Nike, no, not Adidas Continental. And I got some new earrings from a brand called Nordic Muse. There's a shop here in Manchester. That I went to yesterday um, with Freya and I picked these up but they also do them online as well so I'll try and link them if these are available but they're really nice like in between a hoop but anyway this is what I'm wearing just um, very easy and casual I wanted to be quite comfy and warm enough because I'm not sure what this weather is doing but yeah last outfit of the day I hope you've enjoyed the video if you did don't forget hit that subscribe thumbs up um, Go and follow me on Instagram at Lady Jane Tomlinson and I will see you in my next video.